Hey, this is Mac Tips 1000, and I um I'm sorry about the long video wait. It's just that I was busy, and yeah. Um, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make your Mac read Windows NTFS formats. I, since many of you know, I probably have Boot Camp right here, dual boot with Vista. Um, but I can't read. I can't. It's hard to copy and transfer files back and forth. So what I did, as I was googling, um. How to make Mac read NTFS formats. It's actually really simple. To download the two links in the video description. The first one's called um, Let me see. I don't know, but um there are two links in the video description. You have to download the number one and install the first one first, and the second one. And you don't even have to open the program. Just leave it alone, and you'll be able to read and write NTFS formats. Not just read. You'll be able to write. They're not so upset I got from Lifehackers website. First thing you're gonna need is Mac Views, that's what it's called. And then you're gonna want this NTFS 3G Read and Write Driver. I'll put both of these in the video description. First one is Mac Views NTFS 3G Read and Write Driver. You're gonna need after that. It will work on any Mac. Even old Macs like an iMac G3. You need at least Tiger, and it should work fine. Um, yeah, that's about it. It works for me, and it's really easy to do. If you have an NTFS format on any external drive or Windows shared hard drive that you want to read and write with, just download that program. It'll work. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching.